Okay, here's the 89 CR250 taking the right hand side cover off of the engine. Uh, just for grins, I opened up the exhaust valve system and I can work the valves back and forth with the screwdriver. This all seems to be working very easily and smoothly. You can see down here the shaft turning. Normally the shaft down low would be turned by the flyball governor in the clutch cover. And the valves open and close up here. Closed at low RPM and open at high RPM. I believe this was called the Honda power port system. Now it actually prompted me to take this apart. And I was looking to map out how difficult it was going to be to replace this seal. I believe this is where transmission oil is getting sucked into the crankcase. Unfortunately, I discovered that I can move this up and down and forward and back, which should not be the case. So the crankshaft bearing inside is failing. And whether to continue to ride this a couple more times and hope that it doesn't completely blow up and strip the gears and break the case get a few more rides out of it before I have to park it in anticipation of splitting the cases and changing the either the entire crankshaft or the the bearings is uh, the fork in the road for me again whether to go for a couple more rides when I rode recently for about an hour maybe three quarters of the transmission oil went out the tailpipe so it's a fairly serious problem here's that cover you can see the flyball governor mechanism is concentric with the water pump So far, have not had any water pump issues, knock on wood. Well, I think that covers it. Thank you.